Hello Sagittarius, and welcome to Blunt Sagittaro. My name is Robin, and Sagi, today we're going to do a reading about the person on your mind. Let's find out what they're thinking about you, how they're feeling about you, what you can expect from this person in the next couple of weeks. Let's talk about them. And while we get the cards out, let's just wish all of the Sagi sons a happy birthday. Hope you guys are enjoying your birthday season. Um, and to celebrate your birthday, I am giving away some happy birthday readings. So if you want one of those, if you're not aware of it yet, <laughs> I've been doing it for your whole season. Um, just like, comment, subscribe. It doesn't matter when your birthday is. I'm still picking people with old ones, but, well, with ones that have passed. But if you want to answer, you know what to do. I also have that sweepstakes contest going on for the whole month. So you know what to do if you want to enter any of them. Make sure it's me. You'll be told to send an email to bluntsagitero at hotmail.com. I do not have WhatsApp. Um, I don't even know if that's available in Canada, to be honest with you. I'm not sure. I've never checked, but I don't have it. <laughs> I don't want it. Um, there are scammers on my videos the last three or four, so pay attention to that. Don't get scammed. These are free readings from me. So the person on your mind, Sagittarius, has codependent, obsession, possession, controlling, restraints, and the Grim Reaper. Relationship is over. Second chances. Transform your life. So your person's not in a very positive energy. Whoa. King of Pentacles in reverse. Your person's not in a very positive energy at all. Let's see what's going on here, Sag. Let's see what's up. Well, you're on their mind a lot. So you could be dealing with an Earth sign, Swords, Virgo, Capricorn, the Knight of Wands, the Queen of Swords, Temperance. Look at all these people. Look at all these people. All right. And what can, what can you expect? Look at the masculines upside down both times. So I'm speaking to the feminine for sure. And, uh, they're, um, all right, hold on. Seven of Swords. They're, they're, look at this energy. Seven of, I don't know. The sun in reverse. Sad, your person is sad. Your person, uh, your person might be depressed. Your person is feeling, it could be a Capricorn, but they're feeling extremely, wow, down on their luck. Holy come up. Let me just show you what's under there. I can see it. They are feeling like they've lost you and they've gone into some kind of dark abyss here. Look at, oh my God, look at that. The Empress. So they are, they are missing you. They definitely feel like they've lost you here. Um, they're feeling like, like I feel like they're depressed. They've gone into like a, a, a sad state, like, like a moping state, like a, it's not fair state. Uh, they are feeling sorry for themselves. Like I said, they're down on their luck here. King of Pentacles in reverse. What do you want to say? Because it's the, the king and the emperor in reverse. So they might have been unreliable to you. Maybe they're some reliable. Maybe they're just having Queen of Swords. You're coming up as the Queen of Swords in their energy. Woo! And the Knight of Swords. So you're not putting up with any bullshit. They know this. They definitely sad. They are in love with you. Look at this. Look. They. Oh, crap. This person's like. they're sad <laughs> I, I, like I just they're just they are not having a, they don't they don't want to live without you and they feel like they lost you and they are feeling out of sorts they could be drowning themselves you know in alcohol or, or you know um their drug of choice their vice of choice they really do feel like um you're over this that it, but there's that you know see what that knight of wands because it's like we have a lot of people here let's note this they, that's exactly it. They think that you've moved on from them here. Yeah. They've, um, you've gone quiet and they're, uh, yeah. So you've kind of pulled back, maybe gone quiet a little bit. Something happens. Um, but they feel like you're giving to other people. They don't feel like they're the ones you're thinking about. And they definitely feel like you've moved on from them. Um, queen of swords here. You've come up twice that they want a new beginning with you. They want to, I don't know if they know how they don't, as I'm saying that they don't know how to get it. They feel like if they come talk to you, you're going to be guarded um, and you don't want anything. So this person, strength in reverse, they feel blocked. They feel hurt. I feel like they're drowning their sorrows here. You're there, all that they can think about with temperance there, that's you. Um, they're feeling out of control, lost, like their life is spinning into the abyss. And there's the fool. They need to take this leap of faith. Oh, and I said need. They have this need to see you, this need to talk to you. They're trying to figure out how to end their pain. And get this new beginning, but they keep looking over at the pain, not at the new beginning. Seven of Wands in reverse. Oh, this masculine, masculine, masculine. King of Pentacles in reverse. 
the Emperor in reverse, and the King of Swords in reverse. They are so scared. They have regrets. They're, they're, okay. So this person's overthinking about all the work. This person's in a bad place, Sag. Uh, that's all I can say. Whatever happened between you two, they're drowning their sorrows. They're, they're imagining you over and over with other people. It's driving them insane. I have this, like, um, I have all these feelings inside of me and none of them are good. <laughs> I'm just going to say that. Like, um, we're going to get a few oracle messages. I don't see them doing anything though. That's the point. I feel like they're a little bit, um, they feel like you moved on. They're feeling hopeless, but, um, yeah, they missed their empress here. So let's see what this, let's see what the oracle cards want to say. And we'll get your potential outcome. We'll see if anything happens, if they kind of, um, come out of this depression and do anything, or if you even want them to, let's see, let's see how you feel about things, but your person's, uh, drowning in their sorrows. So what does Saj need to surrender to here when it, passion, get out of your head and feel the fire in your belly. Focus on the people or activities that ignite your passion and let it flow. And the caring connection. What do you want to say about Saj and this person on their mind here? Admire. It's time to think of everything that you admire in your, and this is what's on the bottom, in your partner. And look for ways around the obstacles to find happiness. So I feel like that was for the cross watcher. Because if I now I got this feeling that there's a cross watcher here. So that's for you. <laughs> what is the hidden truth? Um, if this person could say something to you, Sag, what would it be? I can't stop thinking about you. Yeah, we know this. We will be together again. They're hoping. They're hoping and praying. Yeah, I'm praying. Let's find out how you feel about this and where you guys are in a month. Because right now I just feel them uh, feeling like they're, you know, down and out, down, down on the luck. And they're feeling sorry for themselves. So energy or, so, sorry, potential outcome. So I say potential because there's always free will. You're going to do the choices and do what you do. And outcome, where are you in a month? Does anything happen between sides and this person? Talk to us. What do we need to know, spirit guides? Where are they in a month? I know I saw one flip. Let me find it. There it is. So, two of cups in reverse, the hanged man in reverse, seven of cups, that's anchoring this because I like five, strength, page of pentacles, whoa, okay, that was weird, so higher fence in reverse, the eight of swords, and the tower in reverse, okay, so let me just make sure those are all on camera because I hate when I, when I watch back and I'm like, oh my god, they weren't even on the screen, it annoys me, okay, so I feel like you're looking at this quite differently and so is your person here. Um, Seven of Cups tells me there's options and there's confusion, but I feel like in the next month, your person's making the choice to come and talk to you. I feel like they're, they're moving real slow, real cautious, real quiet. They are tiptoeing towards you to come and talk to you here, Saj. Um, you're not committed, most definitely. Um, oh, there's the... Yes. In a month is when things start to move forward. Okay. So in a month is when this person comes and talks to you. They are so trapped, but they're removing that. They're going to remove the a prison that they've kind of stuck themselves in this prison of, um, self pity, this prison of like, they're coming out of their depression or their sadness or their, you know, they're coming out of that phase. Like you can't stay there forever. Um, and if you do, please, you know, seek a mental health professional, but, um, they're coming out of that and they're going to start to open up and reveal how they feel. Um, this is a slow process and <laughs> this person's, uh, taking their time. Um, but they're finally making the choice to do that. And I feel like you're starting to look at this in a different way. So conversations are happening in a month. Things are tra transpiring. Um, and this person's starting to kind of remove themselves from this, uh, really sad state that they were kind of hanging out in for a little bit. Um, and at where you go from there is up to you and this person, Sag. So that's what I have for you. You can expect to hear from this person in about a month's time with some honest truths here. And um, let's get your yes or no question to close this off. So if you like your reading, if you like your style, if you want to answer for one of the contests, you know what to do. Just like, comment, subscribe and for your question. If you want to pause the reading, if you have to, let's get your question. So yes or no, what is the answer? For Sagittarius, please, spirit guides. Yes or no. The answer is yes. That's what I have for you. I truly wish you the best of luck. Until next time.